Hi and welcome back to the Morning Report. Charts appraisals for Thursday the 14th of August with me, Richard Perry, Market Analyst at Handtech Markets. I'm going to move on to Euro Dollar now and these the Euro has been fairly well supported actually despite the fact that we've had that weak data out from the Eurozone on the GDP numbers today. Um, and uh, there is no real selling pressure that we've seen in reaction to that and that is fairly um, a, certainly a, for me a positive um, and it just suggests to me that you're still going through this recovery phase yes you you had um, a move high yesterday that uh, retraced all the way back but to be honest you've got a load of long downside tails here that suggests that ultimately that means that uh, intraday moves lower are being supported and it could be what we're seeing again today. You've still got that support from that bull hammer that comes in around $1.3330. That has yet to be breached. That also is um, is the bottom which uh, means that we've still got that, um, that positive divergence, that bullish divergence on the RSI and the stochastics and also you've you've now got this this crossover going on on the um on the MACD lines as well so very interesting that some um, that this recovery in the euro still remains on the table despite the fact that you've had this week GDP data out today 10 o'clock you've got the uh, the GDP numbers out for the uh, for the whole of the eurozone again uh, if that is comes in drastically down from 0.1% now that could have an impact on the chart but certainly at the moment it looks like there is some support for the euro and um the uh, what I've been talking about for the last few days of, about this uh, euro recovery continues to be uh, on the table. In terms of intraday, uh, nothing major in terms of the t in terms of selling pressure. Um, fairly neutral, just slight bearish uh, outlook on the uh, moving averages there. But uh, certainly the, the the momentum indicators are fairly mixed. Nothing too horrendous. Um, but uh, it looks like the all these key lows remain intact at the moment and uh, as I said the, the buyers have returned to support the euro today after an initial just just moved down to the downside on that GDP number but certainly the um, the support is still there and um, the prospect of a, of a near-term technical rally remains on the table anyway I wish you good luck in your trading today and I will speak to you later thank you